There is one thing you can't change with anti-aging cream or plastic surgery. A fake ID that did a great job when you needed access to certain places won't help you either. We are talking about your mental age. For millions of people around the world, their biological and their emotional age are two completely different things. You might be one of them. Want to check it out? Here's an easy but very accurate test that will determine your mental age. The rules are simple. Answer the question picking the first thing that comes to your mind. Seriously, do not overthink. If you get 9 as your mental age, it does not mean your IQ is low. It only shows your perception of the world is young and bright. If you get 60 while you're 22, it's not too bad either. It just means you are really wise. For each answer you pick, add a certain number of points. You get 1 point for each time you choose number 1 option. You get 2 points for option number 2, and so on. There will be 4 options for each question. Let's get it started in here. Starting with number 10, pick a color. The first question is as easy as can be. All we want you to do is choose one of these beautiful color palettes. Really, whichever you like most when you just saw all the options, go for it. Number 9. Pick a meal. If you're hungry, we're sorry for this one, but it is an important part of the test. Plus, that food looks so good! If you could pick any of these meals, which one would you eat right now? 1. Hamburger 2. Soup 3. Pizza 4. Seafood A juicy steak, crispy bread straight from the oven. Will you pick the hamburger? But then again, your mom always told you how important it is to have enough soup. Nutritious and warming up? Or will you go for the pizza? It needs no introduction. Fancy enough to choose seafood? Eh, it's up to you. Number 8. Online preferences. Which part of the internet do you visit most? 1. Instagram, Facebook, Snapchat. 2. News sources, motivational and time management websites. 3. Celebrity gossip and showbiz news, funny cat videos. 4. Mm, I'm not sure how the internet works, but I check my email sometimes. If Instagram means the world to you, pick option 1. You care a lot about getting more efficient and not wasting a second of life, and you must be in the know when it comes to world news, then go with the two. Hey, who cares about politics and nuclear disarmament? Give me some celebrity gossip! You get it if you pick three. Option 4 hmm, speaks for itself. Number 7. Your spirit animal Your spirit animal could be your second self, so pick wisely. Is it going to be Number 1. Unicorn – magical, wild, and free Ooh. Number 2. Sloth – need I say more? Number 3. Shark – determined and dangerous Or 4. Who needs a spirit animal? Question 6. Pick a movie. It's movie night, and you get to choose which one to watch. What'll it be? 1. A cartoon or family movie. 2. Action, fantasy, or horror. 3. A good old comedy. 4. 
drama, romantic drama, or documentary. Now, if Frozen makes your heart melt, breaking every common sense rule, or if you're still laughing at the adventures of Home Alone Guy, go for option one. For those who like to be terrified or thrilled with action, number two is waiting for you. In case you are a hangover type of person, we mean when it comes to the movies, there is option three right there. Crying over the notebook? Go for option four. And do you have a tissue? <laughs> Question 5. Skills to learn. Imagine you can pick a skill to learn with no effort like right now. What skill would it be? 1. Foreign language. 2. Some sports. 3. Management skills. Or 4. Painting. Eh, this is kind of unfair. All the options are so good. But still, one must be better for you than the others. Think of all the traveling you can do when you learn to sprechen Deutsch or hey, talk like a New Yorker. It's a language! Or how fit your body will get and how much cooler you will become when you master basketball or maybe alpine skiing. Or shall it be option 3, the one that will give you perfect time management skills. <clears throat> Not those everyone mentions in their CV, but you know, like really good ones, and make you a financial guru. And then there is painting. If you wouldn't mind waking up to your inner Picasso, go for option 4. Question 4. Dream Vacation Do you want to go on vacation, like, right about now? <laughs> Hit the magical like button, it should get you there! Um, are you still there? Okay, it'll work next time. Trust me. Anyway, pick your dream destination and vacation routine. Number 1. Disney World Number 2. Euro Trip Number 3. Big City Life Number 4. Relax, take it easy! Imagine all the rides at Disney World. Are you screaming with excitement? Then number one is your best bet. But then again, exploring Europe, you're with your friends, including its bars and nightlife. Sounds like a bunch of fun! Hitchhiking from romantic Paris, to fairy taleish Germany, and then to Italy. Ooh, dreamy! If you're a big city life type of person, you can choose to discover New York or any other megalopolis. Sights, arts, and good food everywhere! Number 4 is an option to escape from the world and all its hustle and bustle. A tropical island, or a cottage in the woods, you name it. Question 3. Big money and how to spend it. Imagine you have won the lottery. The money is really good, and you have four options as to how to spend it. Will you choose to 1. Party it up, travel the world, and buy that Chanel bag you've always wanted. Number 2. Spend some of it to buy gifts for my loved ones, do a house renovation. 3. Use it to pay off the bills and that student loan. Oh yeah! And 4. Save it all for my offspring. Question 2. Taking responsibility. Now, be honest with this one. When you make a mess, what do you do about it? 1. Leave it. Someone else will take care of it. 2. Offer to clean it, hoping to hear a no. 3. Silently clean it. It's my fault after all. 4. Silently clean it, because who else will do it? And finally, question number one. 
the meaning of life. So, what's the meaning of life? And that's a philosophical one, we know. But what did you expect the grand finale to be? Pick an option which seems to be the right one at the moment. Number 1. To be happy. Number 2. It is the stairway to success. Number 3. Uh, ask me another. Number 4. To struggle. That is the meaning of life. And we are done with the test. Ready to find out the results? Then do your math and find out what your real mental age is. 10 to 19 points, 9 years old. If you got 10 to 19 points, you are a 9 year old. A cute little child at heart. You're energetic, interested in everything, and open hearted. You react emotionally to every event in your life. You need people to share it all with, and a fluffy unicorn to cuddle with. 20 to 29 points, 15 to 19 years old. Hello there, teenage soul! You are seeking new options. You want to riot, conquer the world, and explore yourself and the people around you. This is the period when you want to find your place in the world. 30 to 33 points. 20 to 29 years old. It's a great age when your true personality is formed. You always know what to do, but you also perfectly remember how to have fun, which is no less important, right? 34 to 37 points. 29 to 55 years old. Your mind level is middle-aged. You know that we are responsible for what we do, and you don't allow your emotions to rule your mind. It's a great age for intellectual activity and self-realization. Career, family life, or both, this is your time to shine. 38 to 40 points, 55 and older. The age of stability, when you don't have to prove anything to anyone and know how to live for yourself. You wear no mask and always stay yourself. Such a philosophical attitude keeps you away from unwanted thoughts and complexes. The golden days. Now, are you happy with your results? Do you find them accurate? Now, are you happy with your results? Do you find them accurate? We have a whole comment section to discuss the test. Feel free to do it. Finally, remember this nugget of wisdom, which has served me well all these many years. You're only young once, but you can be immature forever! <laughs> hey, like this video if you agree your mental age matters just like your biological one. Subscribe to our channel to find out how to keep both your body and mind in a perfect shape. Yeah, both kind of round and lumpy. <laughs> anyway, ta-ta for now!